there's a rumble in the political jungle. Matt Hancock has been kicked out of the Parliamentary Conservative Party after revealing he's joining I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. The former Health Secretary, who we imagine will look something like this, could rake in up to £350,000 for appearing on the reality show. Hancock was forced to quit the Cabinet last year after breaking his own lockdown rules by having an affair with his aide. He'll be the 12th celeb heading to the Australian jungle where he'll encounter a series of gruesome challenges in those notorious Bush Tucker trials. Well, back in West Suffolk, it's safe to say Hancock's constituents are less than impressed. Not happy bunnies, really, when our MPs shooting off into the sun, earning a fortune. Uh, and actually, apart from obviously some of the disgusting things they have to do, actually having a bloody good time. <laughs> well, meanwhile, the local Tory association chair, Andy Drummond, told reporters, well, I'm looking forward to him eating a kangaroo's penis. Quote me. You can quote me on that, he said. Yes. Well, don't worry, Andy, we have, and I think many people will. I mean, there is a serious side in this, and I think some of his constituents and parliamentary colleagues have every right to be really cheesed off when he's the man who embarrassed the party uh, in, in so in, on many levels people hold him responsible for a lot of the mistakes that were made uh, during the pandemic and he's waltzing off raking in hundreds of thousands of pounds and might even not be giving evidence to the inquiry into yeah. the pandemic then there's another side of me that just goes hooray 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 because this is going to be tv Gold. It will be, to be an MP. yeah. It will. It will be. It'll be TV gold because seeing Matt Hancock chowing down on a dingo's anus will be obviously <laughs> vaguely amusing. Uh, the serious side of all of this, of course, is that he's a member of Parliament. He's paid to do a job as a member of Parliament. He's meant to be at work. He's not at work. He's nipped down under to go on a reality show. Second to that, it's summer down under as well. So as his constituents are concerning themselves about a cost of living crisis. He's laying on a hammock, taking in some rays. He doesn't well, care anymore. He, does he? he doesn't no, care. No, he doesn't in care. Fact, this it's is a disgrace, he, Kevin. He's hit. He, yeah, so we but can he laugh about the eating. But stuff, he doesn't but care anymore. He's hit the last shaft saloon. Mm -hmm. He's checked out of Parliament. Uh, did you see that footage the other day, just after Rishi became Prime Minister, and he sort of uh, hat, Matt put his hand out. Oh, it was horrible. And he just <laughs> completely blanked him yeah. and walked past him. Yeah. He was At that cold moment, I think Hancock realised it's all over. He'll be getting between two hundred and three hundred and fifty grand to do this. Uh, and don't forget, he was in big trouble with his constituents over his extramarital affair. They mm. nearly ditched him then, mm. but they stuck by him. This will be the final straw. Uh, he's become a novelty act now. He's got his book coming out, out the uh, Pandemic Diaries soon. Uh, he's cashing in. He's moving on. He doesn't care. Yeah. I just don't understand how he thinks this would go down well at all in any way. And maybe you're right, Kevin, he just doesn't care that this is mm. completely tone deaf. That it's just, you know, as, as cringy he as was. he was, well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, he was always just hugely cringeworthy and just absolutely terrible. Who can remember him crying on breakfast television? In his, I mean, in his turtlenecks. He's just, <laughs> he just is an absolutely terrible MP. He's still getting paid by Parliament when he's by there, us. even though he's by had us. the whip removed. Right. So he's been paid by ITV up to £350,000. Yep. He's been paid by us. I genuinely hope he gets the worst Bush Tucker he trials he will. ever. And also... You know, you've got journalists like Charlene White in there. She's super talented, absolutely brilliant. I really hope she takes him to task and grills him yeah. on what he thought he was doing during the pandemic, which was I, I think, clearly I, absolutely nothing. I, I'd like to think, Penny, that he's going to be the, the the one that gets the Mylene class shower scene moment. I think that oh, Matt... Oh, no, 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 I wouldn't no, no, like no, Matt. No, no, I wouldn't no, like no, And that no. chiseled no. torso no. No. of Hancock Horrendous. will be there Stop for the it. country to Stop it. Nobody needs, at this time of night, it's five minutes past nine, You're nobody needs right. it. Family yeah. show. Yeah. Yeah. It's a family show. Awful. Unequivocally yeah. take that there might, back. <laughs> <laughs> there might be a Labrador watching at this very moment. This is very true. <laughs> Splooting. <laughs> yes, splooting, <laughs> as we know. And, I mean, I, I, I think the problem is, I mean, do, do you think that... I think this is the beginning of the end. I think that there are lots of 
of people, who, you know, who will be in the Tory party. Yeah, so thinking, oh, yeah. thinking, this is the end of the Tory party. We're not going to get in again. Might as well cash in my chips right now. I mean, and make money while I can. And the problem is that there will be, you know, the, the, the trouble is his constituents, and not just his constituents, other people who look at MPs and we're supposed to be holding these up mm. as kind of beacons of rectitude and, and moral turpitude. And we're just... And, and, and everything like this... All it does is make everybody think, what on earth have we got in he, charge? What kind of shower is I, I think he had clearly decided not to stand at the next yes, general I election. Mm -hmm. He's got a 23,000 majority. I suspect even if he had stood with such a big majority, but I bet he would have lost his constituent, his seat after, uh, after what's happened in the last few years. I think he's clearly decided he checked out and he thinks he can do an Ed Balls. When Ed Balls did Strictly yes, and did point. his gang missile, polls were taken after that. He went from being one of the most recognised but least popular politicians to the most but I don't think and the most thing. popular. I don't think but he can make that try. I mean, I get... ...the pandemic in which thousands of people died, and I think that's going to be hard for a lot well, of people... Fault, is it? No, 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 but, but, he went, but, he, but he was part of a department that should have done better and done better. And, he, no, and so mistakes he, were made, and I think that's going to be hard he made, for he made the to rules. That he made the rules that he then broke, and exactly. that is... That's, you know, that's the worst a, thing. That's yeah. the worst yeah. thing. I also think that we would... You know, anybody who knows the difference between I'm a celebrity and Strictly Come Dancing, Strictly Come Dancing, you're doing your dance, you have a little chat, yeah. That's it. The yeah. thing about I'm, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here, is that it's down to the producers, how much they feature you, yeah. how much, what they actually um, quote from you. So you can yeah. say, in passing, a tiny thing that you think is funny, comes across badly, doesn't go yeah, well. Yeah, well, they'll make sure that he comes <laughs> out badly and that what will happen to him is, uh, my guess would be the public... Uh, well, do you remember Jan Leeming? It was like t something like 12 Bush Tucker trials in a row. Yeah, yeah. The, the public voted her Gillian to do McKeith, it. Gillian McKeith, of course. Uh, Gillian, Gillian McKeith. McKeith. So she, he will be the fall yeah. guy that will get to, to do the terrible task time and time Good. and time again. Yeah. And the others, ironically, the others will be really jealous. That's the dynamic. Yes, because yeah, they, 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 be yeah. they, yeah. yeah. they want to do the trials, Kevin, you, you've, had, you've been forced to sit through so I many have, of these realities be, yes. because you wrote about you know, TV... Sure. You know, for, for your career. Uh, and if we look back at the other politicians, I mean, you think about George Galloway when he <gasps> did big, where he had to dress up as a cat, the and it was, catch. I mean, absolutely really cringe. Cringe. Yeah. Ick moment, yeah. yes. which I don't think he ever recovered. I don't think he recovered from that. I mean, <coughs> neither have I. They kind of put him on a curious map. No though, one's in recovered way, though, from that. I mean, in people terms who'd of... never heard of him before suddenly had heard of him, which I guess is what he wants. Mm. Uh, I, with uh, I'm a celeb, politicians don't traditionally do that well. Um, uh, Edwina Curry did okay because uh, she got involved in lots of rows. That came, is agony she watching came, those pictures. She came <laughs> really forth, yeah, watching that yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Nadine Doris, of course, from the Tory party, she got exactly the same treatment. She was yeah. immediately suspended uh, when she was going in because she kept it There's a secret. Nadine. And then she was promptly voted off. Uh, she was the first one out. Yeah, there, there it is. is. First one out mm. she was.